a physical therapist here at SCOE. Um, we have the pleasure of working with a lot of Dr. Snyder's shoulder patients. When they come in for their first visit, we will do an evaluation, go through, ask the patient about their surgery, make sure that they understand what has happened with the surgery that Dr. Snyder did. We will ask them what things are difficult for them um, to do since surgery. We will ask them about their pain um, and how they're doing overall throughout the day. After we do that, we will take measurements, see how well their shoulder and their arm move, test their strength very gently to make sure to protect everything that Dr. Snyder's done in surgery, and then we will begin them with appropriate exercises for their shoulder. Um, one of the exercises that is very popular uh, after shoulder surgeries is the pulleys. We will have patients do it's an active assistive range of motion exercise. Patients will sit. This is an exercise that Dr. Snyder likes his patients to do at home. Um, if it was their right shoulder that was involved in the surgery, they will slowly go ahead and stretch, move their shoulder to help it move, um, of course without pain, as much as possible. They're going to come back down, and they will do several repetitions of this to get it moving. Each time it goes a little bit better, a little bit easier, without as much pain. Here is SCOE and Van Nuys. Um, the patients will come in. We have a large therapy gym that is out here, as you can see. Patients will do several shoulder exercises um, in the gym or else in private rooms where they will use wands, sticks, and other devices to help them stretch out their shoulder safely. This is the pool that we have here in Van Nuys. After shoulder surgery, Dr. Snyder's patients will usually start in the pool to do range of motion exercises in a safe environment to start strengthening and moving the shoulder in a very safe way that protects the surgery. It does not hurt when patients are exercising in the pool. The water is very warm. It's warmer than most bathtubs. It's a very safe and easy way for patients to begin their therapy. Patients will also do exercises to strengthen their shoulder in sideline positions. As we're demonstrating here, he's going to activate and really stabilize to work his rotator cuff, which is the primary, primary muscle, group of muscles that need to get strengthened after surgery.